Hi guys, or should I say, hello ladies, hello doomer chicks. Uh, well, it has happened again. We have stumbled into a beautiful Sunday here in the end times, at the end of this dirt road in the Point Lonesome Swamp. Uh, and it is now Sunday morning. February 14th, 2021. February 14th, 2021, that would be Valentine's Day. So uh, take a wild guess what your old Doomsday Lonely Heart is doing here on Valentine's Day with his little Valentine. This is as close as I will get to a Valentine today on one of of course, one of the most depressing days of the year to be a depressed collapsitarian, Valentine's Day. So I'm going to do what I have done every February 14th. Is this the 11th or 12th Doomsday Lonely Heart Valentine? Where, Hamba and Little Dale, your old Doomsday Prophet, Doomsday Lonely Heart himself, is announcing to the Doomer Chicks of the world that I am still available. I know this is absolutely flabbergasting, astonishing, just there, there is no way to understand how Hambone Little Tail, after 11 years down here in the Doomosphere, is still available to the Doomer Chicks of the world. I am, uh, I am available, I'm easy to find, and uh, you just have to come get me, and let's see, <laughs> this is it, so of course the main, the, the main thing you get uh, with me is you get the coolest little doomer dog on the planet, Sancho Panza comes with the package. Uh, you get this lovely open air kitchen here in the Sunshine State. You get a little cabin on 14 acres of beautiful land outside of Ithaca, New York. Comes with the package. Uh, you can see how stunningly handsome I am. And that just goes without saying, uh, this, this hunk that you get. Uh, <laughs> now the, the hair, I, I will say I, I'm not attached to the hair. All right, ladies, if you don't, if you want me to lose the hair, that, that can be arranged, all right? I'm, uh, if the hair bothers you, the hair can go. I am not attached. Uh, I'm thinking about chopping it all off anyway as the weather begins to warm. Now, of course, if you were sitting here with me instead of probably where you are, wherever you are sitting, like me, you would probably be hanging out today in a Hawaiian shirt and barefooted instead of bundled up. Uh, looking like a, an Eskimo woman today. So Anyway, ladies, I know you're out there, but of course this year uh, <laughs> I, have, I have put an extra level of just hopelessness onto my never-ending search for my Doomer chick, and that is, of course, now I am looking for an anti-masker Doomer chick. Uh, good Lord, uh, if I thought I had it tough for the last 10 or 11 years, now this newest wrinkle is an anti-masker Doomer chick. But I know you exist. I know you exist because I personally know... All right, let's do a count here. One, two, three, four, five... I mean, I personally know five anti-masker Doomer chicks. Uh, so I know there is such a thing as a Doomer chick 
who does not live her life in fear of some saber-toothed tiger outside the cave ready to pounce on her and kill her uh, with some bogeyman. Now, of course, uh, at least two of these Doomer chicks who may or may not be watching them, uh, watching this video, know that I am ready, willing, and able to be your Doomer dude forever. All you have to do is say the word, because I, I, I know at least two Doomer chicks who I am pretty much ready to say I will spend the rest of my life with you and make you my Doomer chick forever. All you have to do is say the word and uh, we can arrange it through all of the odds stacked against us. Uh, I really know how to pick anti-masker Doomer chicks. But there are two of them on the planet. And uh, you know who you are and all you have to do is say the word and we will be the Doomer duo. But uh, I understand the level of the level of uh, I won't say impossibility. Miracles do happen, so uh, I will continue my search because I know you are out there. There is some woman on this planet who uh, look, looks at me and this channel and my other channel, Collapse Chronicles, and fully understands that she has half of a brain in her body uh, that I am trouble. I, I, <laughs> I will not deny the fact that being Hambone Little Tail's Doomer Chick does pose a few challenges to any woman on this planet, but uh, some woman out there understands that I am worth the, uh, the hell you will probably have to pay uh, at some point to be my Doomer chick forever. But, uh, you know, going through all of these hundreds of ads on pile of fish dating service from all of these normie women, you know, it's the same thing over and over that women claim they're looking for. So, uh, I have a brain, I uh, own two pieces of real estate, at least for the next six months. I am financially secure. I am emotionally and physically available. I am not a complete gross fat slob. Uh, I do not own a television. I have no interest in uh, professional sports. You will never lose me to a football game. Uh, I have a cool little camper ready to travel. I have a canoe. I have a kayak. I have a pickup truck. I have time. As they say, for the next few months, I have money. I have time and money. Don't anybody ever let tell you that that is not the best combination. I have the world's coolest little dog on the planet. Uh, <clears throat> so what else but it, it does an anti-masker Doomer chick need? I'm sitting right here at the end of a rutted out dirt road in the Point Lonesome Swamp. Here on this windy but warm day here uh, in the end times, I am easy to find. You just send me a message to Humpty Dumpty Tribe at gmail.com <clears throat> saying, Hambone, I'm willing to take a chance on you and your little dog. But anyway, speaking of my little Valentine dog, uh, my little Valentine dog 
says uh, he needs to go poop, I think is what this means. Pop, I need to go poop. You need to wrap this up. And so we're going to go, I'm going to go take my little dog for a Sunday walk in the park. Come join us. You know where to find me on Valentine's Day 2021. The end of the road in the Point Lonesome Swamp. Did we leave anything out? How can you resist? How can you resist this combination? You know you want uh this is uh if you don't want me kissing on you every morning, imagine waking up to this little dog every morning. Come get me. Bye ladies. Alright, little dog. We've done it again. We've sent the message out to the universe. Now we just have to sit around like Charlie Brown waiting for his Valentine from the little red-haired girl that never comes. If any little red-headed Doomer chicks out there listening to this, I'm waiting for your Valentine. Bye, ladies.